Gambia has a rich culture and can develop it internationally. We are the words of Tunde Jegede, a British scholar maestro. Jegede made the remarks at a recent exhibition that peddled the birth of the living legacies. This project aims to document and standardize the cultural legacy of the Senegambian period and their uniqueness. I came to the Gambia in 1981 at the age of nine, mainly to study how to play the 21 string trailing musical instrument and to dig out the roots of its originality, he said. The project launching that attracted a large cross section of the public. We are entertained and sensitized with Tunde's documentary subject of the living legacies. A line of talented Gambian curators were shown through a project group, whom Tunde revealed plans to stage a giant concert in the shortest possible time. Sambususo stated that Gambians got the talents and the only way forward is to build the platform to showcase it. She said with the efforts of commitment of Gambian musicians, Tunde should be uploaded and given support to promote Gambian music internationally. Sambu said what touched her emotion on the show was the moment she saw her father and mother perform in one platform. I could not control my tears, she said. Yusufa Suso, a xylophone player, said that he started playing the instrument at a tender age after his father taught him. Suso said that he believed that his talents could make him internationally famed in Fiji. Alaji Sise, I Africa TV News.